Hello guys and welcome back to the Manchester United career mode episode 2. I hope that you guys are having an amazing day today. You guys had so much love to give me on the first episode of the Manchester United career mode that I had to come back and record another one because honestly I was just blown away. I was not expecting all the love and all the responses that you guys gave me on the first episode. So thank you guys so much. Um, I hope that you guys enjoy the first episode. If you haven't seen it yet, be sure to go check it out. There will be a link in the description box of this video for the first episode. Go watch it so you can be up to date and then come back and watch this video. But if you enjoy the career modes, be sure to give this a big old thumbs up. And if you're new, hit that sub button with your bunny paw to join the bunny family. Also, don't forget to ring the bell. That way, whenever I drop a career mode, you know that it's live and you can come hang out and watch it. Okay, so to give you guys a little recap of the first episode, if you forget or maybe if you miss it and you don't want to go back and watch it, we signed Cristiano Ronaldo to Manchester. United, which is huge. We paid a little over a hundred million dollars for him. I tried to get him for around 75, 76 million, but they were not having it. They wanted over a hundred mil. So we ended up paying about half of our budget for transfers last. So you're gonna try to sell a player this episode and let's just get right on into it. Okay, and now to start, I wanna go to my notifications and see if anybody has picked up or is trying to pick up any of the players that we have put on the transfer market. Remember from the episode one, we put quite a few players on the transfer list. Hopefully we can sell a few so we can get a little bit more money to buy a few more players. I am taking requests down in the comment section if you want me to buy any players in particular or sell any players or just if there's anything you want to see me do in this career mode, don't forget to comment it down in the comment section. And if you see a comment that you were thinking, then don't forget to like that comment so that way you can see like a little tally of who you want me to buy. So in the first episode in the comment section, I did see somebody put that they wanted me to sign Zhuang Felix. And so I was kind of thinking about that. I definitely don't have an issue with that. So to start off, we have a Barcelona offer for Anthony Martial. So he it is an $80 million offer. However, I don't think I want to take this. I know you guys love Anthony Martial and I kind of want to find a way to make Anthony Martial fit in with the team better. So what I'm thinking, what I'm hoping, if you guys like this, let me know if you guys are liking the Zhuang Felix comment or not. We could have Ronaldo and Zhuang Felix as the two strikers, put Anthony Martial as the right winger and then have Mason Greenwood as like a backup, you know, interchanging right winger as well. Well, that's kind of what I was having in my head, what I thought would be cool. So let me know what you guys think about that idea. Um, So we obviously are not going to take that, but let's just see what else we have. We have a Rashford offer. So I'm not going to be taking Rashford because I don't think we're going to sell Rashford. Okay, so Inter's reached out and they want to offer Nangolin and $56 million for Marcus Rashford. Now, I don't think we're going to do that. I don't think you guys want me to sell Rashford, but you just, you let me know. Real quick, Liverpool wants to buy Cavani for for $30 million. I'm kind of tempted to sell Cavani because we do want to get Cavani out. No offense to Cavani, but we do want to bring in another striker. Like I was telling you guys, it's kind of what's in my head. So you let me know if you want me to sell him or not. And then we also have another inquiry for Anthony Martial for $82 million. So Barcelona came in for 80 and then woo, Calicio came in for 82 million. And then the final offer is from Bayern and they want to buy Timothy Mensa for 7.6 million. So let's look at our let's look at our player chat. Our players have been kind of hitting us up a little bit. Greetings boss on behalf of the whole team. I wanted to welcome you to Manchester United. Thanks McGuire. He's not very happy though. He's he's his morale is a little. Okay we just made it go up. He's happy now. Grant said I'm glad you decided to put me up for sale. To be honest I haven't really enjoyed playing here and I think a move is probably in my best interest. I completely agree with you man. Do firm handshakes on that one. Say that we both agree on that. Then we got Romero. Hey boss I'm a bit surprised you're looking to move me but I can't say I'm unhappy about it. It's nothing personal, my guy. I'm gonna say it's the best thing for you because it really is. We're not gonna be playing him very much. Hey, boss, I'm a bit surprised that you're looking to move me, but I can't say I'm happy about it. I uh, will just say I'm looking at options because I need some of that money. And then we got Axel. I'm glad you decided to put me up for sale, to be honest. I haven't really been enjoying it here. Okay, so it's kind of the standard. Same thing. I'm just gonna keep saying, looking at your options, all that good stuff. Bit surprised. Best thing for you. We got Mensa. Glad you put me up for sale. Glad we agree. So Mensa, we, we were originally looking to sell him. Bayern wants to buy him for 7 mil. Let's see if we can negotiate a little something, something. I'm kind of open to negotiate Mensa. So it is saying that his market value is between 5.8 and 8.6 million. They're offering me 7.6. So I'm going to negotiate it a little bit and try to get a little bit more money for him. Now, if you missed the first episode, this is me. This is manager Ray right here. Good to see you. Hello. Nice to meet you, sir. I don't, just my swag is so nice. Don't comment on my swag unless it's going 
will say mwah, beautiful swag. Ready to offer you 7.6 for Mensa. And I, I'm gonna look for eight, honestly. I'm not gonna lie, that waiter just scared the poop out of me. He came in there and was like, hello? Let's propose a new transfer fee. So he's saying 7.6, and I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 8.1. That's quite a bit, but we'll just see. You know, the, the value it was saying is a little bit of, a little bit around this range, so we're thinking 8.1 is more realistic. That's fine, it's a deal. Oh wow, we actually sold him for 8.1. I should have asked for more, but I was, I legit, I thought that I didn't want him to run away. You know how like some managers get really upset and they like run away? So we sold Timothy for 8.1, we got offered 7. Point something. We got, we got a little bit of a, we got a little bit of a mwah, little bit of some money. Okay, so since we just sold Timothy, let me go ahead and show you guys uh, just kind of a little recap on who we had listed on the market so far. So we do have Cavani, we have one Mata, we have Pugba. I really want to try to get Pugba out of here this episode. That way, if you guys want me to buy a powerhouse striker or just anybody in general, we have quite a bit extra funds. So I want to get rid of Pugba, want to get rid of Rojo. We have offers for Cavani. So let's see uh, how much they want to give me for Cavani. They're looking to give me 30 million and he's between 30, 22 to 33.5. I'm going to negotiate and try to get like 32, 33 million for Cavani. All right. So since it's Liverpool, I feel like we should try to sell Cavani for a lot of money. I don't know realistically if this trade would actually happen. So please don't get mad at me. He wants to offer me 30. Let's do 45. It's 15 million that we're looking for. Not too out of the park, but 45 mil is more realistic. We think evaluation of 45. We cer wait, we certainly want to sign Cavani, but 30 is the best we can offer. Heck no, Techno. Absolutely not, sir. There is no way that I am giving you Cavani for $30 million. You're crazy. We're going to have to go ahead and canter out for that one. I'm going to propose, I'm going to propose 40, 0, 0, 40 mil. That's my final offer. And if not, then I might have to just wait for another team, honestly, because I, I feel like Cavani will get picked up regardless. But you know what? I just, I don't know. There's a little unsettling part of me that Liverpool wants him. You know what I mean? That's our final offer, I'm afraid. All right, we're gonna have to go ahead and walk away. Let me know in the comment section if this is a bad move, but I'm gonna reject it. Absolutely not. Look, there's no way I'm arguing over this. You revised, oh, your revised offer for Kalmani is still way too short. You know, we gotta go with what's with best. So let me know what you guys think about that. If that was an L or a dub, because I'm, I'm still a little bit new to this. So for Anthony Martial, I'm just gonna go ahead and hit him with a no. Rashford as well. Rashford was a swap deal for nine gold. I don't think so. I don't I don't think that's, that's really worth it, to be fair. 50 mil plus nine. Goal and he's 32 valued around 32 mil and to me it's just not even even with night Golan's approximate like value and what they want to give me it's not what the game is saying that anthony martial is even worth so we're still gonna or i'm sorry not not anthony martial rashford so excuse me so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna cut that thing in the bud anthony martial is another offer but i think i'm gonna have to get it through the message all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and delete these messages. And now just for just for poops and giggles, let's just see how much Zhuang Felix is. Okay, Zhuang Felix. And let's go ahead and scout him. And then I'm gonna put him on our short list because we don't know how much he's worth. I don't wanna, if we do wanna get him, I don't wanna go in and offer him undercut and then, then just walk away initially. So let's just see what he's worth. All right, so we got an offer for Phil Jones. He's worth between 5.2 and 7.7 .7 mil. And they're offering me 6.7 mil. So I'm gonna go ahead and negotiate it and try to get it like a 7.1, 7.2 mil. He's already on the transfer list as it is, so we did want to get rid of him initially. See how much we can get for him. Why don't we get started? Yes, sir, why don't we? Let's skip through the pleasantry, shall we? Let's just get through it. 6.7 mil fee for Jones. You know what, that's just not gonna work with me, Grandpa. I'm gonna go with 7.25. Submit that offer. We'll see if we get it. <laughs> Hopefully we get it. Valuation of 7.510 is more realistic, in my opinion. I can understand not being able to let Jones go... Oh, and we got him for a 7.5 mil. I'm so happy with that. Honestly, I didn't know. I didn't think we we're going to be able to get him for that, but I'm happy with that. That's awesome. Now we got two of the players that we originally put on the transfer list taken care of. We earned about 14 mil with those two players today. So, you know, our money's going up a little bit each day. That's freaking awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and let's keep simming. Uh oh, Spurs have expressed an interest. 
interest in sending Luke Shaw for 38 million. Luke Shaw is on the transfer list. Let me just go ahead and make sure. And there he is. Luke Shaw is right there on the transfer list. They're saying that he is worth between 36 mil and 53 mil. So they want to offer me 30, 38. So I'm going to try to get closer to that 53 margin. I don't know if we're going to hit it, but I'm not that pressed to hit this to be fair because I feel like once we start winning games, it'll it'll be good. We'll be good. We got Jose. All right, Jose, let's see. Let's see who's the better manager at negotiating. <laughs> Willing to pay 38 mil. That is not a figure we can agree on, sir. The game tells me that he is worth around 50 something at max. So I'm going to try to get close to that 50 something. I'm going to hit him with a 50 mil. He's worth 50 mil to me. Jose might not like that. He might get very mad, but you know what? It is what it is. Submit that thing. 50 mil is more realistic. I really hope I didn't just screw this one. 38 is the best that he's saying that they can offer. So I'm going to renegotiate for about 40 mil. 41.3 mil. We're not prepared for anything less than 41.3 Anticipation. I can understand. We made the deal happen. Let's go. Okay, look. It's it's about 9 million less than what I was trying to get originally. But, you know, we sold him. They're saying his value is 35 and they were between 35 to 51. And we got 41. So not too mad at that negotiation. I feel like that was pretty good. Went pretty well, I hope. So now on our transfer list, we've sold three of the people. Boom, boom, boom. That we had we really want to get Pugba gone but so far dude we have about what it's almost 16 I'm gonna round up and go 16 mil with Timothy and Joan we'll just say 15 so so far we're about 56 56 mil for the day that we've made off our players so that's a pretty big I feel like that's a pretty big pretty big gain financially for our next players that we're gonna be signing all right so we're gonna sim the friendly and hopefully the team does good we're gonna see how everyone does hopefully Ronaldo gets closer to that bonus a little gold bonus originally that he had. We'll see what happens. Like I said, I do want to get a formation where we can have two strikers and put Anthony Martial as a right winger. That's what I'm really hoping for, but let me know what you guys think. Remember to comment down in the comment section who you want me to sign next. If you guys want me to sign um, João Felix as our, our next striker and you want me to kind of put that formation in play, or by the way guys, we are black. We are not red. We do not root for red. Let's go black. <laughs> Let's go black. <laughs> At first I was like, oh, we're doing good. I didn't realize that we were not red. Also, if you're enjoying this career mode so far, be sure to give it a big old thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell. That way, every time I post a career mode, you know, and you can come hang out and watch it. Oh man, I thought, I thought that was, I thought that was in. Come on, boys. I'm holding the controller like I'm gonna do something. Remember, I'm only gonna jump in the games if I need to on a need to basis. If I don't, then I'm gonna sim them and we're gonna watch them like this as a team. Come on, man. You guys can do this. This is only our second game so far. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Get the ball. <laughs> oh, God. Let's go, ooh, run, oh my god, Pugba, you should've ran faster, let's go, bro. All right, come on, come on, pass it to, oh, I thought Ronaldo was gonna put it in right there. I thought that was gonna be it, but, nope. Oh, what the, what the heck was that? Oh my god, it's halftime. It's halftime, so we're gonna make a little bit of adjustments. I'm gonna go ahead and, and change my tactic a little bit. I'm gonna put the depth up one, Hopefully we can come back and we can score. Hopefully we get a little bit of momentum scoring in. Give us a little bit of that, whew, that excitement that the team needs so we can go ahead and keep kind of pushing and chugging along. Come on guys. No, 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 no. Oh man, let's go baby. Let's go on. What the hell was that? Mason, what are you doing my guy? I think that was Mason, right? I, 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 I wanna say that was Mason, I don't remember though. <laughs> I looked at it and then I forgot. My mind blank. If we don't score by the 75th minute, I'm going to jump in and hopefully we can get a, 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 a goal. Come on, boys. Oh. Let's go, Mason! Let's go, baby! Hey, first goal of the game. Mason Greenwood scoring that little boop, boop. That little tap, tap up in there. Hopefully, hopefully we just, look. All we have to do at this point, oh. Ronaldo! See! 
coming in hot with that. I, I wasn't even done congratulating Mason by the time Ronaldo came in there. Look, the team is on a roll. They have some energy. They're excited. You can see the excitement the way they're playing. Look at them. They said, boop, boop. Look at them. Look at them go. They got Mason Greenwood really set the tone with that that goal. Because now the team's going like they, like they, oh. Look at that. Would you look at that? The energy has completely changed this game. Just because Mason Greenwood's one little goal, that thing changed the whole tone for the team. They look like they're so confident now. They're like, they're just, they don't even care. They're like, man, who? We were three up? Don't even matter. Let's get it. Let's get a hat trick hero. I don't, I don't know who would be the hat trick hero. Seemingly it'd be Ronaldo, but honestly, like, you know, there's only 10 minutes. I don't see that happening, but it could happen. <laughs> All right, now they're starting to look a little, oof. Go on, you got that. Wasn't the, really the greatest shot angle, but it's all good. Okay, okay. Oof. Come on, guys. Let's just get one more and just for fun. One more just for A. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take it, guys. I am so pleased with that performance. 3-0. And we got we got one goal from Bruno Fernandes, one goal from Raldu, and then one full goal from Mason Greenwood. Mason Greenwood was the first one to score, then Ronaldo within like two seconds, and then Bruno Fernandes came in. We had, we had 68 possession, eight shots, six chances. I mean, I feel like we did really well with that, that friendly, honestly. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. If you guys thought that was a pretty good game, I thought it was a good game. I'm not gonna lie, I was a little nervous. I was a little nervous going into that because they looked like they were kind of hesitant, was going kind of slow, but as soon as I said I was gonna jump in there, they said, absolutely not, ma'am. You are not gonna play for us. You're gonna watch from the sidelines. Let's see what we got now in our notification. Just wanted to congratulate you and wish you the best of luck as the new manager of Manchester United. It's a little late. We're a couple days into this at this point. As your agent, I will now keep an eye out for potential opportunities to coach a national team. Oh, in addition to your club duty. Okay, cool. So this is my manager basically saying like, you know, if I wanna possibly be on like a, you know, a, a national coach. Let me know if you guys want me to become a national coach if we get an opportunity and if we do what country would you like to see me coach for who do I say no to until we get to a certain country you know what I mean Timothy and his representatives have agreed personal terms with Bayern a deal to sell it's all in place so oh awesome board has allocated 6.5 mil for your current transfer budget that's that's freaking awesome I'm so happy with that all right let's do some training now all right also wait Phil Jones just sold they agreed to the terms so cool we got six mil in the transfer budget for Phil Jones that is freaking that is so awesome I'm so so excited. All right, wait a minute. Axel. Uh oh, they want to buy Axel for seven. Oh, for 9.2? Excuse me? Axel was put on the transfer list by us already. So I'm kind of okay with trying to negotiate his deal. Maybe getting like 10.1. We'll, we'll, we'll go for 10.2, a good 10 million up for what they're offering. This could be a big day for transfers for us in, in regards to money. Hopefully we make a lot of money. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip through some of this. That way you guys don't have to watch the same old, same old. 10.2. I'm a little nervous going in for this but you know what let's go in not trying to cut corners on the deal I promise you we want him to join us but we can't go higher than 9.2 Ooh, he's saying they can't go past 9.2 I'm gonna try to get him at 9.6 so they can't go above 9.2 let's see if they can actually can always go above baby they can always go above we got him at a 9.6 if you guys can't tell by now I am a penny pincher every dollar every hundred thousand dollars in this case counts and matters to me we just have to wait for the deal to go and once the deal goes we just sold four players today wow this is a huge transfer day all right we're gonna delete this okay so now it is a training day let's go ahead and train a little bit I haven't done any of these so I'm gonna have to go ahead and play them all that way hopefully we get A's get some A's and uh you know we'll see what happens when simulating the drills the player will receive the highest performance great okay let's start the drill okay so we got a B on that drill somehow you know I tried it twice but finally got a B I'm, I'm happy with the B man we have bees all around. I am so happy with bees. Bees are great. Let's sim and see what happens. Hopefully we get an offer for Pugba. Oh, Luke Shaw sold. Oh my goodness. Let's go. All right, so Dortmund expressed interest in, in Harry Maguire. Wow. So for now, since we didn't put him on the transfer list, I'm gonna leave that up to you guys if you want me to sell Maguire or not. I kind of feel like it'd be a good thing to sell Maguire, honestly, because he's 27. He's not super old, but he's definitely not a young lad anymore. And he goes anywhere between 40 
39 and 72 mil. They're offering me 46. So we could try to push it up to like 60. Take nothing less than 60. But I'm gonna leave that up to you guys for the next the next episode. So let me know, okay? Maybe not. I'm gonna put them in there for the, the little the little boost. The little boost. I don't really know what the, the 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 green versus red is. I'm assuming that's a chem thing. So I feel like we would want them all on green. So I'm a little bit nervous to put them all, put a couple of them on red. So I'm gonna leave it how it is for now. Oh, they wanna buy Eric Bailly for $25 million. And I don't think you guys want Eric Bailly gone. So we're gonna go ahead and keep him. We're gonna, re we're gonna reject this offer. Let's see what's going on in our player chat. I know you will be eventually looking for a replacement left back. I think I can fill the role if you give me more of a chance. All right, he wants a chance. So I'm gonna say it'll take some hard work. I'm not gonna give him too much hope, but we're not gonna tell him no either. So for Eric Bailly, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna say no, cause he's not on our transfer list. I don't think you guys want him gone. I didn't see anybody in the comments say to sell him. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna reject the $25 million offer for him. Because honestly, I don't really, I just, I don't know, man. I just, I don't want it. No. Okay, so one more thing I wanted to do is you guys said in the comment section to change Ronaldo's number from I think it's 15 to 7 so I'm going to do that kit number boom hey that's fire did you guys know that you could do this you can make them wear different boots hey that's actually fire dude I'm gonna make them wear those boots those are those look those look BA okay so I found out how to do it um I thought that's where I was supposed to go, but it is wrong. So here we go. Let's change his kit number from 15 down to 7. Cavani currently has his kit number, so I'm gonna go ahead and steal it from Cavani because Cavani's gonna be fired anyways. No offense, Cavani, but you're gone anyway. So now let's go into our next match of the, the, the day. We're playing another friendly. We're gonna do the same thing as we did before and go ahead and sim it. Hopefully we can have Mason or honestly anybody pick up the pace for the game. Hopefully this game has some really good like momentum to it. Also, we're red this time. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. Uh-oh, uh-oh. All right. Oof. We might have to do the same thing that we did last game and change our, our tactic at the halftime, but hopefully we can get a goal in before that. Oof. On Juan Bruno, Pazzarado. What the heck was that? Mason, are you serious? You really thought that one was gonna work? What the heck? Oh, I thought that one was going out of bounds. I did not think he was gonna get that. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, well, what the heck? <laughs> what the heck was that? Let's go, Bruno in the freaking clutch position. First goal of the day, let's go. Ronaldo was a little bit on the tail end. He was a little bit behind uh, at when, when Bruno scored that. So hopefully that kicks his little butt to gear and he kind of tries to stay a little bit more diligent. Let's, oh, oh I'm scared. What the heck? <laughs> Come on, man, do something, jeez. All right, it's halftime. It's halftime and currently it's 1-0, 50-50 possession. We have two shots and one chance. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm not gonna touch the tactics right now. I'm gonna leave everything as is. Um, and we'll see, we'll see how everybody does when it's not, you know, one depth up. Oh, well, come on, Pazzarado. Ooh! Look, I'm okay with that, honestly. Bruno's being a little bit of a ball hog. Maybe a little bit. I don't, see, I don't think that would have been the best option to pass it to Ronaldo there, but he just took that chance. He did not care. He said, mm -mm. he said, you have a bonus for every time you get a, a goal, every so many goals. I'm trying to get that bonus too. Let me go ahead and boop, boop. All right, let's see. Come on, baby. Let's see how the team's doing with their fitness levels. Let me see if I need to sub anybody in, sub anybody out. Pugba is about to die. Let me go ahead and sub out Pugba because he is... Pugba is literally, he's like, you know what, man? I'm, I'm I'm dying over here. I can't do it. I'll just can't do it, Captain. So I'm gonna put Vanderbeek in, and Ronaldo's looking a little bit hurt. A little bit like, you know, he's, he's not hurt, but he's, you know. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna put Anthony Martial in for him. That way he gets a little bit of play time. Uh, Alice Tell is doing good. Juan is doing okay. I think we're gonna keep everybody else how it is for now. All right, so let's, let's go ahead and... Uh, Let's see what happens when we put Anthony Martial in with Van de Beek. Oof. Honestly, we just need to defend now. That's all we need to do. Just defend, just don't let him score. 
but I know our our our, our defenses right now are really tired. <laughs> they are like freaking dying, dude. Let's go. All right, there's we went on a little bit of overtime, but we're good. We're good. There's no way that they score two goals, so we're good. We are perfect. That's the whistle, boys and girls. That is the whistle. We had 52% position, four shots, two chances. And we, we you know, we, we've mixed in a, a few players. Got Ronaldo a little bit of a break, as well as uh, Pogba. Pogba and Ronaldo were looking a little bit tired. Ronaldo not super tired, but I am just, I'm just trying to take precautions so he doesn't get hurt. All right, before we head out for the day, we're gonna go ahead and check the the office. Let's see what's, what's going on, okay? Axel proposed to move to FC. Oh, the proposal, it's been broken down, so they couldn't reach that, that terms of agreement, which really sucks, honestly, that sucks. All right, it's cool. Um, we're not gonna be selling him now. All right, so also Lazio has expressed an interest in signing Daniel James for 23 million. So you know what we might do? We might go ahead, he is on our transfer list right there. We did wanna put him up already, so Let's try to sell him. The game's saying he's worth between 19 and 28 mil. They want to buy him for 23. So let's try to get that 28 mil. Let's see if we can get the maximum that he's worth in the game. They want to propose 23, but we are going to go ahead and counter offer for 30. I hope that that doesn't bite me in the butt. I'm hoping that they'll be like, oh, we can't do 30, but we could do like 29 or something like that. Hopefully he doesn't walk away. They want to increase the offer to 26 million. They don't want to do 30. They want to do 26, which is still a pretty big jump from what they originally did, but we're not going to go ahead and accept that. You already know we're going to try to go 28.5. 28. Five. 28 Five is a pretty good balance. It's only two and a half million from what we, a million and a half from what we wanted originally. So if we can get it to 28, 28, five mil for him. We wanted 30, but we'll take 28. It's quite a bit of jump of what they were like offering to begin with. So honestly, I am happy for that for James. Louis, <laughs> they, they don't, this doesn't fall through. All right, also we made a little bit of money here from the, the cup. So we got a little, a little 2.8 million added to our transfer budget for winning a few games. So that's, that's always a dub. That's always a good thing. All right, so now for our transfer budget, we have 145 million, which is a good, it's a good little chunk of change to have, you know, in our back pocket. So hopefully, hopefully, if you guys want to sign Zhuang Felix, he won't be over 145 mil. I don't know if he will be, but hopefully he's not. So don't forget, if there's anybody that you would like to see me sign in the next episode, comment it down in the comment section below. Don't forget, if you see a comment that you like, that you're like, oh, I want, I do want Zhuang Felix, like that comment, even if it's not your own. Like the comment, that way I can just see likes. All right, that being said, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Career Mode. If you did, be sure to give it a big old thumbs up and if you're new hit that sub button with your bunny paw that way you can go ahead and join the family also don't forget to turn on your bell that way you know every time i post a career mode or a draft or anything like that remember if you have any suggestions or anything you'd like to see me do in the next career mode feel free to drop a comment down in the comment section and i will see you guys in the next career mode bye guys